Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining to you guys how you can scan a QR code for Epic Games. So let's get right into it. Now, the reason I am on the two-factor authentication page on Epic Games on the site uh, is because the only way I know to get a QR code for Epic Games is to actually enable two-factor authentication for the Authenticator app. So I'll be going over the instructions on how to do that. Now, the way you enable this is you go to your account page and then go to the password and security tab. From here, you just need to click on two-factor authentication uh, and you will see or go to that section and you'll see the Authenticator app, the email, uh, two-factor authentication and SMS code two-factor authentication. You just need to click set up and if you click on uh, the two-factor authenticator uh, and click set up, you will get the uh, QR code to connect your account with a app on your phone. First, of course, you need to download the app and install it on your device from whichever app store you have. And then once you set up, you will get a QR code, which you need to scan. And once you scan it, your uh, two applications will be connected. Now, every time you log into Epic Games, you will need to use the code uh, in the Authenticator app, which is a six digit numerical code, which you need to input. And that is pretty much it. Now, the way you scan this QR code is, of course, you go uh, either into your camera, since most cameras uh, on phone phones now have a built-in QR code scanner, or you can use some third-party QR code scanner from other apps. I know Viber even has one, so you can use that. And then you can just easily scan that, and that's pretty much it. Now, the only other QR codes I know of are for Fortnite products, uh, physical products, if I remember correctly, since you do need to verify if they are actual Fortnite products and not some knockoffs. So if they have a silver QR code, you can scan them just the same way and it'll open up a site telling you if the item is real or not. And that is pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll be seeing you guys in another video.